What's up guys and welcome to the 101st episode of the 7 Minute Squad series on FIFA 14 Ultimate Team. Now, if you guys are looking to purchase any FIFA 14 coins, check out the fifashop.co.uk. They're very fast and reliable source to buy your coins from. All the links will be down in the description below and you can get an extra 5% off using the discount code JACK54HD. So, um, I would honestly just like to say... Thank you so, so, so much um, for the support on the 100th episode. It was absolutely insane, like, incredible. Um, and we, we literally, I think, we pretty much got 10,000 likes. And I asked for 5,000, and I was thinking, that's a bit steep anyway. I didn't really think I was going to get that. But 10,000 likes, that is just, that's unbelievable. It's completely, you know, just, just... I don't know, overwhelmed me basically, um, and I can't thank you guys enough, and if we could get like anywhere like a quarter of the support of that on every single 7 minute score builder, that would be absolutely amazing because it's so motivating, um, and you know, you guys don't understand how much it really does have an impact on me, you know, really, really wanting to make these 7 minute score builders. Um, so yeah, that's just what I'm saying, uh, I just wanted to say yeah, like a massive thank you, I really, really do appreci appreciate it. And uh, hopefully we can do another 100 episodes as well. So, let's move on um, to opening these packs. I did open two. We got Gustavo and also, uh, what was his name? What was his name? Subatic as well. Um, so that's okay. It's not really good. We kind of used them before in hybrids. Um, but also, guys, the 500k giveaway on PS3. We get Pastore there. <coughs> do you know what? I'm going to use Pastore because I haven't... I feel like I kind of lack in using players like him, so I really want to try him out, and apparently he's pretty good on FIFA as well. Um, but yeah, 500k giveaway on, P on PlayStation and on Xbox will be on Twitter, okay? It will be on Twitter uh, this Friday, okay? Stay tuned. Actually, no, it will probably be, it may even be tonight. Basically, go into the description below, follow me on at Jack54HD, um, and I'll give away... Uh, the 500k I'm get on PlayStation and on Xbox uh, very, very shortly. It'll probably be tonight. If it's not tonight, then it'll be tomorrow uh, for certain. That's if I can get any coins. Um, so I'm doing my best to get these coins. I did. <laughs> Basically, you would have the giveaway now. But um, yeah, when I did my when I did my video, <clears throat> and uh, hold on, let me just get the timer started, and then I can get underway with this video. So the timer is going to start in three, two, one. There we go. So, basically, um, the problem was, when I actually did the 100th episode, I bought a load of players, which, uh, when I sold them on, it was during the time that the EA servers were down. So, you know, I paid, uh, what am I doing here? Uh, you know when I paid 550k for Infinite Lovetsy? He sold for 122k, because that's what he sold them for. Um, yeah, that's, that's really annoying, isn't it? As you can tell, and I also bought the second informed Baradi. He cost me 125,000 coins. He sold for 12k. Yeah, lads, 12k. 12k. Oh my god, it was so annoying. By the way, I don't actually know what formation we're going to be using. Um, we are going to be using the 4-5-1 formation with a center attacking mid, then the right mid, and the striker. So, there we go. Um, right, I actually need to buy a center attacking mid now. Right, yeah, uh, yeah, it was so, so, so frustrating. I can't even describe it. It was just the most annoying thing ever. Just to see my coin, to coin total, literally half, basically, uh, was the most frustrating thing. But we're going to go ahead and buy Verratti for the center attacking mid spot. We've got about 5 minutes 35 left. Uh, plenty of time, if you ask me. So we'll place a bit on Verratti here. And, uh, yeah, where do we go now? We can go ahead, actually, this... Whoa, whoa, whoa. So I really do apologise about that. Um, but yeah, we need to go now into... Uh, well, we can go anywhere. Any Italian sounds like a mid, can't we? Kind of want to stray away from the, the Serie A, because that's just default. Like that... If... if <laughs> Basically, if, if you're looking for Italian players, you go into the Serie A, don't you? So, um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I might go ahead and buy Diamante, actually. He is a very nice looking player. I know there's one there cheaper. Who does he play for anyway? Bologna. All right. Or oh, Bologna. I don't know. I really don't know how you pronounce that. But anyway, four minutes, 57 left. Uh, left midfield. Let's go Serie A. And let's have a look at that. Bologna. Bologna. 
Okay, so there's none. Class. Um, yeah, fantastic. Right, so, where are we going to go now? We're going to have to have a look at left mid in the Serie A, basically. Um, Tarat. Tarat is a good option. Um, yeah, maybe Tarat. Maybe Tarat. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go for it. Let, why would we not go for that? I've got a good idea as well. For the centre mid spot, we're going to go into the Barclays Premier League and buy Giacciarini. You guys know him. Who does, it, does he play for Sunderland? I think he plays for Sunderland, doesn't he? But um, yeah, he will be a, he'll be a nice player to have in that centre back, in that centre mid role. Uh, so Giacciarini, there we go. He's not a bad player on FIFA as well. 80 pace and 83 dribbling. Uh, that is very, very nice indeed. So... Let's go and have a look at some Sunderland centre backs. I believe Diakite actually is a centre back for that. Yes, he is. Okay, that's decent for us. That's not bad at all. Um, but something we do need to think about is because oh, we kind of need another Sunderland centre back, don't we? Oh, inform Wes Brown, you have done me a massive favour. A massive favour. Um, oh, well, actually, do you know what? We've pretty much done this team now, already. That's weird, because I wasn't really thinking that I was going to be able to do this team, but has actually turned out alright, I think, anyway. I hope this uh, this is right. So, right back to double letter, so he gets a good link with Pastore, I think. Yes, that is going to work. Uh, left back, we're going to have to go back into... Actually, no, let's go ahead and get the goalkeeper quickly. Quickly, let's get the goalkeeper... Uh, and we're going to go ahead and buy Joe Hart because he uh, will get good chemistry with uh, Wes Brown. So that's why we're going to go ahead and get him. I might see if there is in for Does he have an inform? Does he have an inform? I think he does, but do you know what? I haven't got time to look for him. Uh, we've got 2 minutes 45 left. So, left back then. Let's go Syria, Milan. And then I think we're actually done. Actually, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, we're not. Uh, shit. Yeah, that's a problem. We need to get an Italian left mid, don't we? Oh, God. Yeah, we need to get an Italian left mid. Didn't think about that. We're going to have to go ahead and buy... Well, any Italian left mid, basically. Well, to be honest, we do need to go ahead and buy El Sharaway. Because uh, otherwise, Constant won't get full chemistry. This is a joke, but you know what? There we go. Um, we're going to have to go ahead about, yeah, El Shirawe. But I have used Tarat quite a lot recently, um, so it's not that much of a bummer. But yeah, I think that is the team done, guys. I'm pretty sure anyway. Um, so yeah, I will basically be back uh, in a second with the finished team. Let's do this. This is the finished team, and yes, it does get full chemistry on every single player, uh, as you can see there. Um, we are going to apply a... Team training, of course, we want some fitness in there because quite a few of the players don't actually have full fitness. But guys, let me know in the comment section below what you think of this team. I think it looks pretty nice, you know. I think it's going to be something different from what we usually uh, make. You know, I've never used Inform Verratti, never used Ghiacciarini either, um, barely ever used uh, Diamante as well. And you know what, I want to try out Pastore. And the two centre backs, uh, apart from Diakite, Di I've never ever used. So, you know, it'll be interesting to see how well Wes Brown plays. Uh, but yeah, guys, let's move on to this match and see how well this team can play. This is our opponent. He has got a full Serie A side. He's got in for Mycon, upgraded Benatia, Vidal, Perlo, you know, a, a load of really, really good players. And I'm, I'm hoping we can do well against this team. Um, you know, we've got the likes of Menez, uh, Diamante, you know, Verratti as their attackers. So I'm, I'm, I'm confident we can get a couple of goals on the board, but hopefully we can actually turn around uh, and try and win this. Fuck, no. 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 Get that out. Oh, my God. That de that deflection could have so easily gone in. That would have been terrible. But nice bit of play here. Pastore. And uh, who was that? Zabaleta working pretty well together. I I'm, I'm liking Pastore. You know, I actually am. He hasn't got much pace, but he's a very sort of fluent player. You know, he, when he's on the ball, he, he has some agility. Um, and he, he, he feels, you know... Faster than 68 pace or whatever it's suggests in this card. Um, he really does. And I like the fact that he's got skill moves. If he didn't have skill moves, I think he'd be such a bulk standard player. Um, but you know what? His passing, you know, just everything about him so far is looking really, really nice. And I can't wait to try him out even more. No! No! Wes Brown made that challenge. What a challenge by Wes Brown. Go on. Lovely stuff by Pastore. That's strength. That's strength. Finish that. 
Oh my god, Pastore. We go, we got we got a free kick here. Can we make anything of it? I'm gonna definitely keep Diamante on this. Here we go. Let's do this. Go on, go in, please. Oh my god, what a strike by Diamante. No, this is gonna be a lovely goal. Fair play, what a goal. Did you? That was incredible. Fair play. Right, it's going to be the halftime whistle, guys. Let's go and have a look at some of the halftime stats then. So, I've had eight shots, four on target. He's a two shots, one on target. I've had 87% pass accuracy. I feel like I'm in, a, I'm in the driving seat. But, you know, it's all going to pan out in the second half. And it's going to be down to who's going to take their chances. No, please. What a save by Joe Hart. Fantastic save. Right, we've got another free kick, lads. Can, you know, am I, I'm going to put Diamante on this. He's got fantastic free kick stats, as you know. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to hold down uh, LB. This is what I do. I hold down LB. And I push this left uh, analog stick forward so it gives it a bit of curl. Uh, and I'm going to see if this is going to pay off. Let's see. Oh, my God. That was close. Go on. Get the cross in. Who is going to be here? He's going to get it in. What a save. That was absolutely unbelievable. Over the top. Go on. Get there. Finish that. Finish. No. Oh my god, that was such good play by Menez. And that is going to be the end of the video, guys. If you have enjoyed this, then be sure to leave a like. That would be absolutely amazing. Remember to hit that like button if you want to see more 7 minute squads from me. Have a nice day, and peace.